All right, so today's actually kind of exciting for me in regards to this video because for most of you that have been watching these videos for the last couple days, I've been trying to invest in my little office room over here so that I'm not necessarily editing downstairs on the couch or the kitchen table, which is where I usually was doing all my editing because I find that when you're working from home a lot, and anybody that works from home can probably attest to this, it's really hard to separate work from just life. So you end up sitting in front of your computer working all your waking hours. So me and my wife were like, I need to separate that and set up the room for an office so I actually go to work. So this is the two rooms, this room and that room over there that that happens. So when I'm downstairs watching TV or having dinner or doing whatever, I'm there, I'm present. I'm not working on my computer trying to figure out how to get things moving around or what I should be editing or whatever. What I didn't realize was how warm that room was gonna be. And we do have air conditioning in our home. For some reason, that room over there, and I'm not sure if it's because the computer's punching out so much heat, but it gets warm without question. And you edit for like half an hour, you're like, oh, it's so hot in here. So hot in here. This room gets warm too, because I don't know if you guys can see it, possibly these lights or this light, there's two lights. You don't see one of them, but two lights. It is the only light in here that produces heat, but it's not on all the time. That computer's on almost all the time. So anyways, I was trying to figure out a way to cool that room. I saw this, the desk cooler fan. And I was like, yep, trying it out, because if it's something that I can just put on there, and I can turn it on when I want to cool the room down or when I'm editing, I can just go on and turn it on. That's fantastic. So we're gonna look at this and we're gonna see if it actually helps cool the room down. Cause if it does, that's awesome. And if not, maybe I just gotta go get a fan. We'll see. Okay guys, so right now you'll see <laughs> Now is the time to buy, it says on the website. Normally at $59, it's 49 right now, so that's excellent. 49 bucks, it only has three stars, so I'm not sure. Some people love it, some people don't, and I, and I don't understand. I don't know why, why are they saying they don't, does it say? Uh, low energy consumption, auxiliary cooling. Uh, small cools the air, but not immensely. All right, just ask someone to blow on you. <laughs> I, I have a comment in my head that I'm not gonna say. But you get what they're, what I what I might want to say, but I'm I'm not gonna. Okay. Anyways, this this is gonna be something again. This is a desk cooler fan. So realize what it is. It's not a small room cooler. It's a desk cooler. So my thought is that you're gonna be on a desk and you're gonna have this like right here, and it's gonna help you stay cool, which is exactly what I'm looking for. So I would normally unbox this, but I've done it already because. There's a few things that have to be done before you turn this on. So first off, here's the box. Just so you can see, there's not a lot on it. Desk cooler fan, desk cooler fan, voila. What's in the box? Nothing, right now, nope. So, first thing to realize, this is it right here. I was a little worried when I threw that back. After I threw it, I'm like, oh, where is it going? But I think we're okay. The one thing I like about this, there may be more, but the one thing for sure, I love the kind of retro-y look it has. It's just got this cool little, little leather strap. It's super light. It's got a little switch on here. You guys could probably hear that. Play it with some music, you're off to the races. And inside, again, you may, you may be able to see, I don't know, there's a little fan right there that's gonna blow. So it is a fan, primarily, it is a fan, but this is where it differs. So inside here, this little top comes off. Now, when you open the box, there's gonna be two cartridges here and a second cartridge that sits in the box. So I'll bring them up here as you can see. These are the cartridges right here. These are the cartridges. And these you fill up, don't fill up, up to this max line with water. Now, I brought them both up here just to kind of show you guys, but one of them goes in here and the other one you keep in your freezer so that when this one melts and it's done, then you have another one, you just go replace them so that you go back and forth. Not like, well, this one's melted, now I gotta wait for three hours while my fridge or freezer 
freezes some more water. You also, with this, which you are supposed to moisten, so you just run it under the tap and throw it in the freezer as well. And these go in, in here. So you put them back in here. Now, the one thing to realize as well is that the bottom, hopefully you can see it, there's a little tray here, and it does say that these need to be out when this happens, but this slides out, and this is where all the melted water would drain into, so make sure that's in there. And this, simply, I guess, you just kinda slide this in here. I don't know if there's a front and a back to these. I can't remember which way they came out, so I'm gonna try to take this one out me oh i think see there's a notch right here there's a notch on here so my guess is that is designed to make sure yeah so there's a notch so this goes in the back one that little notch and then this goes in the front one that makes more sense and and you know now which is front and rear because of this little tiny notch right here hopefully you guys can see that so we have a notch we do have a notch which is excellent and then this we simply close back up like so and that's good that's excellent nice now lastly it does come with this little USB to whatever this is plug in and that goes in the side here so we're gonna I'm already getting warm in this room already happening so this is this is good test so we're going to plug this in here okay I'm gonna reach over here I'm kind of excited. Make sure it's off. It's off. Okay, plugged in. Ready? Ready? Oh, come on now. Who said this doesn't cool you down? And again, you have to... That's lovely, and it's quiet. Sit there with that on. But it has to be closed. Like, if you were way back here, would this cool the... Oh, no, I can even feel that there. Would this cool the room down? Uh, maybe, maybe a room this size, definitely nothing bigger, but listen to how quiet that is. And that's at full. So I think, like, you need to kind of understand what you're buying here. Few things for me, I don't want something loud. That's the issue with buying a fan. Sure, they put out a lot of wind and they put out that, which is great. But this, oh yeah, see that's, that's lovely. I like that. And there's a little LED button, hopefully you guys can see that. So if you want this little glowy LED on or off, you can. If you want it to look cool, who doesn't want it to look cool with a little glowy LED kind of going on there, see that, and even on the back? Right? That's fancy. Yeah, it's not gonna be like crazy cool, but I think for me editing, I just have that off to the side. That's gonna be lovely. I think that's perfect. All right guys, I'm gonna leave you there. Um, I get the rating if you're expecting this to be like an air conditioner that's gonna cool a room. It's not gonna do that. This is a portable desk cooler. It's for cooling the desk. And if you're sitting here working with this on you, yeah, that's nice. All right, guys, I'm gonna leave you there. Link down below if it's something that you think is cool, if you're interested. It's the Smart Devil portable air conditioner, fan smart USB desktop air conditioner cooler. This is cool too, because it's USB, you could, you could take that in the car. You could, if it was, if you had a cooler, maybe maybe you could get away with taking it camping. Just kind of throw that in the tent at night, just to kind of give you some some coolness. The the hotel, if you're traveling and you need to get to the hotel, because they have a cooler, usually to keep your drinks cold. You could freeze these up. Now you got a little air conditioner. Ah, it's kind of cool. Yeah, it's all right. All right, my friends, I'm gonna leave you there. Like, comment, share, subscribe, and again, links links down below. Hit the notification bell if you want to see more little doodads and knick-knacky kind of technology stuff. And uh, that's it, my friends. We will see you tomorrow. Later.